hello. Um, I just have to um, get my two cents in on this issue about God hating anything. Um, Phelps, um, I do a little astrology. I don't predict the future, but I understand human nature pretty well by using a, a mixture. It's called the New Astrology. It's Western astrology mixed with Chinese astrology. And if you know this Phelps man, he's born in Scorpio under the Chinese sign of the snake. He is all that Jesus preaches about to beware of. He is a lie. He is, has nothing to do with the love of Christ. For my God, my God of my understanding, teaches us never to hate anything. That we bring our own pain upon us by failing to love our fellow man. And he came to abolish all the laws. We all sin and fall short. And that's the beauty why Jesus came to die for us. I can't believe that this the United States is so gullible and so naive to fall for his propaganda. Uh, Scorpio, snake, get it? <laughs> if you want to talk about the Bible, it talks about the serpent. <laughs> yeah, wake up. <laughs> God doesn't hate anything. We do. We are eaten up by our hatred and our bitterness and our anger. I bet some of them drink. That was an abomination to, the, to God, too, in that church. I bet they have a beer every once in a while. I bet they have sex before. Them. I bet even some of them touch themselves. All this is supposed to be an abomination. But we don't go around bullying and terrorizing them. So he, without sin, cast the first stone in whatever capacity that is. Uh, Phelps, I don't hate you. God doesn't hate you either. You're the only one that's hating around here. And I feel sorry for you and your family, especially your children, to be raised with such hatred and bitterness. God have mercy on you.